Okay, now we'll go through the MM reading. So there are various ways to load the cases. If the cases has already has a workflow attached to it, you can just double click or you can right click and open or open with, with a different workflow if needed. The workflows can be chosen to be up in as a favorite by just clicking the star on the side. This allow quick access to the most used workflows. USB only is to open without any saving of results. Then assigning is to just assign a workflow without opening. And you can set it as a mark and also set the series or the patient data to protect from deletion from the single VR server. So MM reading. So the MM reading has three workflow steps. One is the overview. It just gives a general overview of all the series available in the patient folder. The 3D viewing is for MPRs and VRTs. This is where you can visualize the series and do image manipulations. So right mouse click, hold and move is for scrolling. When the mouse is in the image, left mouse click is for panning and outside the image is for zooming. So the crosshair allows visualization of particular points. The tools are all available in the four corners. If you end up of whatever the tools is to be used for, you can just click on it. And a brief summary of what the tool is for will be given. Okay, for the MM reading, there is the spine and rib labeling tool, which is only available in the MM reading workflow. So you can have the machine auto run the spine and rib labeling. It's only recommended for adults 18 years and above. So once the computer has finished processing, just check on the images to see that it's been correctly labeled. Confirm the spine labeling and then you can run the rib labeling. The rib labeling will take about one or two, two minutes. Okay, so this is the VRT. So if you need to change the VRT gallery, it's here. You can change it to the presets. Yeah, I think that is. Yeah. Because there's not much ribs, so we'll choose a case later with more ribs. I want to do a quick comparison in MM reading. Look for the series navigator on the right. Right click on the series that you want to compare it with. Right click, drag, drop, and add series. Then we can do a comparison. So if you need to compare a particular segment, just right click enlarge orientation and you'll be able to compare segment by segment. To exit, just double click.
So to do volumetric, your eyes at the top right hand corner, the, the view I free hand. Choose the first image. Skip. You can skip a few slices. Double click at the end. Click on create view eye. And the view eye will be created. The volume will be provided. To escape from any active tools, just press escape in the keyboard. This is the spine and rib labeling finish running. As you can see, the ribs all labeled with the left and the right, numbered from 1 to 12. To hide the spine and rib labeling, just go back into the spine and rib labeling and just turn off. So if you need to exclude a series from viewing, you can just right click and exclude series. So if you want to create new layouts, you can press on the layout button, under advance, you can edit the layout if needed. New layout can be created in other workflows. And also it needs to be administrator login. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.